And so to the last question, question seven, two curves, they intersect at the point and they want the point of intersection. Well, that's simple, you just substitute the equations. What do we call that one, call that two? So I'm going to substitute one into two, I think. So intersection, substitute one in two. So I'm going to have 4 to the x equals 3 to the 2 minus x. First thing you'll do is you'll pop them down. Oh, I've got a suspicion. I might as well head for that. It wants to use a for this part. Right. Take the logs of both sides. You can take any log you like, but it seems to suggest you just call that a, just to keep it any number. So I've got log a of that. It's log a of that. Pop out the powers. So I've got log a of 4 equals 2 minus x log a of 3. I'll let that sit and wait just now while I multiply that out. So that's 2 log a of 3 minus x times log a of 3. And I'll bring that over to join this. So I've got x log a of 4 minus x log a of 3. And I'll leave that one over there. In fact, I might just tidy that, put that back in its box now. Common factor of x. I know I could just jump straight to the answer, but I'll set it all out. That came over as a plus, of course. Plus log a of 3 equals, I'll pop it back in now, log a of 3 squared. Next time I meet that, I'm going to make it 9. So I've got x log a of the product. I'll just show that by saying 4 times 3 equals log a of 9. And then finally, x is going to be log a of 9 divided by log a of, and 4 threes are 12. There you go. There's the x coordinate of that point of intersection where A could be any number you like, so you could evaluate that. You always get the same answer. Part B, calculate the y coordinate. It says calculate, not find an exact value, luckily, because I don't want to be writing something like, so I'm not going to substitute it back, and I don't want 4 to the power of this business. But since x, A can be anything, I'm just going to choose anything convenient. I'm going to choose A equals 10, which means x is going to be log 10 of 9 divided by log 10 of 12. And it's just a case of putting that into your calculator. So I've got, where's my buttons? Log 9 divided by log 12. And that gives me point 8842288 and so on. I'll just leave that just now because it's not actually wanting me to write that down. Which means that y is going to be substituting that into anyone. So I'll just put a wee note. So using number 1, y is going to be 4 to the power x. So it's going to be 4 to the power, 0 0.884228 and so on, which I've still got in my answer function, so I'll just do that. 4 to the power answer is 3.40689, blah, blah, blah. No idea what many significant figures they want that to, because it just says calculate it. So I'll just make that 3.41. And there you are. Put a wee t. Y t is 3.41. Or if you actually wanted it, it didn't actually ask for this. T is going to be the point 0. Point, well, I'm using two decimal places, 0 0.88, 3.41. But it didn't actually ask for that. And there it is.